Good morning. This is Kavi. Jared woke up not doing very well today. I woke up and I could just feel like, I don't think it's my sartorius, but it's one of my quadricep muscles. If you have a desk job, you can return after two weeks. I was like, oh man. I mean, obviously I'm gonna be at home working, but like driving to a desk job, I was like, I thought I'd be able to get back sooner than that. You're just gonna have to deal with me, Ellie. Oh, great. I think I can do that. What's going on in there? <laughs> what you cooking? You making something for me in there, huh? Jared has a straight shot to the kitchen. Jared can see you guys straight from his room and he goes, what, 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 what are they doing? <laughs> so good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you for being so sweet to us, guys. Oh, heavens. We're, well, and I don't want to make you feel bad. We're sweet to everybody. Oh, you, oh, you are? <laughs> it's not well, just you, Ellie. But, but especially you. <laughs> Why do you think the world revolves around you? <laughs> that was actually really sweet. And I was just going to say, my parents have hosted and have had people live here and have cared for people my whole life. So I know it is definitely not just me, but I really love that because you guys really are so sweet. Well, you're sweet we, to us. Well, and what's nice is that I get a good breakfast out of the day. <laughs> Heck yeah. Tom, you are so obsessed. And I am obsessed mm. of your obsession with grandpa. Where's Jackson? Where's Jackson? Yeah. That seems to be the story of the day. No one knows where Jackson is. Where's Jackson? I think he's downstairs. Can you look downstairs? All of the kids are just like, where is he? Maybe he went and hid. I think he's been a little done with his brothers. <laughs> <laughs> Last night he went to bed and he goes, can I just have everyone leave me alone? And I'm like, yes. <laughs> I think he was just done. Are you kidding me? You're so cute. Oh, it does not look good. It looks amazing. I can't see it. I just gave you a little egg, but oh, I'm gonna go get thanks. some more made up. Thank you. And mom obviously wearing our Bali brand robe. I love it. I went downstairs and there was two down there. I know, I love it. If you guys haven't seen our new colors, I'll have the link in our description so you can check out bollybrand.com. So today, Jared is able to shower, but he really needs to work on his stretches. So before we get up <clears throat> out of bed, we are going to, he, <laughs> we. You're involved in this too, sister. <gasps> We're going to do stretches. First, it shows he gets on his hands and knees, which sounds, Hard. Now read me the instruction. <laughs> <laughs> Begin in a neutral position on all fours. Check. Begin to slowly shift your weight back and rock and towards walk. your heels till you begin to feel slight stretch in your glutes. Perform 10 to 20 of these two to three times per day. Oh, that actually feels good. Really? Yeah. Do you want to just like lay in bed or are you like, oh yeah, I want to stretch? I want to do a good combination of both. Like I don't want to delay any recovery, but I also don't want to go too far mm -hmm. and like do it too quickly. Will that reach? No, let's see. I don't think so. No way, it wouldn't reach. Okay, do you have like a rope? I'm sure your dad has some twine. hanging in there. The weight of my body doesn't really hurt my hip that much. I still feel the separation from my hip and the joint hurts. I got you the best rope in town. Holy cow. Your dad cut this? Yeah. Oh, I should get him a new rope. And frayed the edge. Oh, this feels so good. It does. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm so glad. Oh, that feels good. It's just like a really good stretch. Yeah, breakfast, lunch, and dinner, I'll just do stretches too. Yep. I've got to earn my food and medication. <laughs> so sad. Guys, it's so sad. Do I look pathetic? No. I feel very emotional watching you, Aww. to be honest. If I could do it for you, I would. Oh, you're so sweet. But instead, I'm just going to film you. <laughs> <laughs> Don't make me laugh. I think that's what hurts the most, is when I laugh. Oh, your dad made me laugh so hard yesterday, and I could not What did it. he say to you? You've never oh, laughed. Oh, I don't know, but it made me laugh. Me and Crutches will just watch you. Yeah. <laughs> Well, after Jared's exercises, he got really, really woozy before showering, so he is now resting. 
and laying down really pale we did take the dressing off his scar and we wanted to show you so if you don't want to see it skip forward the two smaller incisions i think are from the scopes and i think the larger incision i might be wrong is from when they tried to remove the pin the pin and that's his previous scar Did i clean up okay you look great i feel good i mean like the clothes feel really nice and you smell great <sighs> I don't stink anymore. What is it like when you shower? It was hard. When I was taking my clothes off in order to get in the shower, I was like, whoa, and I almost passed out. I These two are what they used for the scope to go in and do all of the cuts and all of that stuff. Yeah. And I think this one was from when they tried to get the pin out. The reason why I think that is because he, the doctor called it the P-I-T-A. Pain in the A screw. A screw because That's it's so bruising back at the Oh yeah. End. Yeah. He said most surgeons don't even use that screw in the more anymore because it is so hard to get out. Is it gonna wiggle itself to the surface again? No. I doubt it. If He's, they can't get it he out. He said when it's in there it's it's all yeah. in there. If they couldn't get it out, it's not well, going to Well the part anywhere. that irritated you though was because it was it, because it was sticking out. I feel like this is a big adventure that I'm going on. Oh yeah. All of Jared's siblings are in town and they're all gonna talk a little bit tonight before the funeral tomorrow. Good job, old man! And I helped. <laughs> I was talking to both of you oh. too. <laughs> Wait, where's that little bear? <laughs> so I can put my head around him again. I'll go get him. Doesn't matter how old you are when you have surgery or you're sad, a stuffed animal always comes in handy. Mom is going around taking pictures of everybody. <laughs> so now we're filming her. Now we're filming her, but everyone is, like all the cousins, aunts and uncles have been here. And it's just been fun to visit with them and talk with them. Look at this. When Nate's up there. We're getting our whole people family all together. When people are Hey. <laughs> Me and, and Ellie started a picture, then then Melanie came in, and now everyone's joining in for this picture. Oh, your poor legs. I'll zoom in. Okay. <laughs> It's probably good you're getting a picture because Jared's not going to remember this anymore. Anyway. No, he's not. <laughs> he took his medication an hour ago. <laughs> he, he said, can you stand with just without your crutches? And I went, yeah, like I can do that. Okay. Uh -huh. He said, if you flap them hard enough, you can fly away. That's so cute. Yeah, I should probably go. Thank you for helping your dad. And I look around and Jackson's running, beelining it to Jared and he wanted to stand right by him, which I thought was really sweet. So the boys definitely are aware of you and they want to like help you. I love that about kids. So sweet, boys. Ah! Here's a present for you. Thank you. I'm gonna go put these in the back. Perfect. Thank you. Is there anything else I can do for you guys? Um, like a mint maybe? No, should we leave a tip or something <laughs> well, yes. all at the door? Yes. The doorbell, thank tip you. your waiter. Thank you. Now okay. that I'm in the car and I'm buckled in, you can finish your class. I jumped in the car, started filming, and then looked up and Jared was slowly walking to the car. And I was just like, I feel like an idiot. <laughs> okay, what I was going to say is this is summer. The kids have stayed up late, like, yeah. the last several weeks. And this is the first summer that I feel like we've actually really enjoyed letting our kids stay up late because they're old enough now. Like, they're not so exhausted they're that like they're throwing fits. They're not, like, and, yeah. So, and they will actually sleep a little bit later, which is really nice. They're not waking up at six in the morning, they're waking up at 7.30, 8 o'clock. Yeah, and right now it's nine. So it's like, I don't know, it's just fun. This is like our first like- Family summer. Family summer where the kids are old enough to like really enjoy the evenings mm -hmm. and I, I love it. <laughs> Let's get them to bed. I think it's safe to say that my pants were the hit of the evening. Every single person complimented on your pants. They did, and I don't know if they were just being polite or if they actually liked them. They were really stretchy, and I think people liked them a lot. I like them. Should they I look show really them cozy. Yeah. Watch. Look how much stretch that is. That's like, crazy. That is so much stretch. Okay, we gotta go to bed. We have a big day tomorrow. It's all about grandma. It's all about grandma. I have my outfit laid out. The boys 
outfits. I just got them new, like, nicer shoes. So glad that my mom and dad are gonna watch Tommy all day tomorrow. It will make our day go a little smoother, having the older boys and just being around family. Tonight was so fun being around all of our cousins and aunts and uncles. So we'll see you guys in our next video. Bye.